The magic continues for the SEMO women's tennis team. The Red Hawks did it again, defeated SIU Edwardsville today in Paducah 4-2. That gives Southeast its second straight Ohio Valley Conference Tournament Championship. This marks the first time SEMO swept both the regular season and tournament titles and clinches their second straight NCAA tournament berth. Tiona Velasquez's 15th straight win in singles secured the victory, gives Southeast a record 17th win of the season. They tie that record, I should say. The Red Hawks will find out who they'll face in the NCAA tournament. When the bracket is revealed Monday, May 1st at 5 o'clock, congrats to head coach Mary Beth, Beth Gunn. She's done a great job with that program and all her players. Outstanding. Well, the SEMO baseball team comes up just a run short at Moorhead State, a battle of the top two teams in the Ohio Valley Conference. Eagles win 7-6, take the series 2-1. They also take over first place in the OVC, at least for now, right? Meanwhile, Peyton Leeper went 3-for-3 three for, three for Southeast with a homer. The Red Hawks host SIU Tuesday at 6, Kappahoff Field, of course. Meanwhile, speaking of those Salukis, second place SIU playing at first place. A team in the Missouri Valley Conference, Indiana State, ranked number 22. SIU gets out of a little bit of a jam here. Uh, and, and by the way, they got out of that one in the third. They were up, or excuse me, down 2 nothing. Lance Rhodes, their head coach, of course, a Sykeston native. He would see the Sycamores, though, break through an inning later. Bases loaded. They would start cashing in. And SIU falls to Indiana State. The final was 10 to nothing. And by the way, Indiana State 13-1 leading the MVC.